Do you know anything about the Enox? Like their lore? Yeah, so as I said, the Enox are um, sort of like the Kinari in a way. Oh. They're very strong, muscular. They're not they're not as feared as orcs traditionally are um, in, you know, Tolkien universe and um, D&D universe, but they're not, they're not, many humans don't trust them. Um, just like many, many um, humans in Dragon Age don't completely trust the Kinari either. Mm. Um, go ahead, Kevin. Encounter. You are headed through the mountain mountainous region when the ground begins to shift and shake beneath you. Taken off guard, you fall to your knees. The tremors continue unabated and grow stronger. You hear rumblings as rocks begin to tumble down the mountainside. Do you try to find a clearing where you can avoid the falling rocks? Or take cover under a nearby outcropping and wait out the earthquake. Oh. Oof. Hmm. This is actually a tough one. Yeah. Uh... I'm tempted to take cover under a nearby outcropping. Okay. Rocks can trap us in there. Brilliant. <laughs> it might. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just I, kidding. <laughs> I feel like there's going to be a negative either way. I just don't know which one is. Which worse. one is worse? Yeah. Yeah. Frag hot. <laughs> you Frag speak hot. rock, don't you? <laughs> That's true. <laughs> no. So maybe having the crag heart would have, would help us avoid the falling rocks. Maybe. Maybe. That's, yeah. Um. I. So my guess is. If we try to find a clearing where we can avoid the falling rocks, we'll probably take damage, which for our group is okay because we've got a lot of heals. Mm -hmm. If we take cover under nearby outcropping and wait out the earthquake, I feel like we're going to end up, um, I don't know, like lo having to get rid of two, discard two cards at the beginning of the scenario or something like that. I don't know. That's wow. my that's my guess. Ooh, so, I don't like the discard thing. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, it's also possible that the discard happens with finding the clearing to avoid the falling rocks because of exhaustion of trying to run. So that also is a thing. Um, I don't know. I feel like with since we have the crag heart, maybe we'll have a better chance at finding a clearing where we can avoid the falling rocks. But I don't know. That's just my gut reaction. I guess, Kevin, you can be the tiebreaker. Um... I think we should try and find a clearing. Okay. All right. Let's okay. see what happens. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's what I thought. Go ahead, Kevin. You race forward, scanning the area for an open space where the danger from the rock slide will be less severe. After dodging some rocks and getting hit by others, you find a relatively safe area and wait for the chaos to subside. Each character starts the next scenario suffering two damage. Yeah. That's not terrible. That's not Those terrible. were boulders. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We've got a lot of heals, so I think we're, we'll be okay. All right. So we have to clear out this Enox encampment because Jexera says that they're trouble, basically. So this merchant wants to make an example of some caravan raiders. Yeah, seems reasonable enough. <laughs> For the right amount of money, almost anything can be made reasonable. Okay. You enter the Dagger Forest and begin to track down the encampment using Jixera's crude map. It is well hidden, but following the signs outlined on the parchment, you find a dense cluster of huts in a small clearing of the forest. All that's left is to head in and make that requested example. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay, I think I'm good. Um Yeah. I okay. think I'm I think I'm good ready to go 
Oh, I gotta hit into dungeon. That might help. Cool. So we have to kill um, five times the number of mercenaries. So we have to kill 20, 20 characters, 20 enemies. One and, hope, enemies. and hopefully Sam can kill one of each type. Hopefully. Heck yeah. Oh my gosh. What in the heck? Look at all these. Wow. One, oh. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All right. Eleven in the first room. I always love hearing you guys' reaction because my screen takes forever to load. I'm like, oh no, what is it? I'm like, oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> oh, so, no. so um, the Anox guards are melee. So that's a good thing. The archers have a range two, so they are gonna have to move up to hit us because they are pretty far back. The shaman is annoying because I think he does like buffs and debuffs. I think he like heals people and strengthens people, which gives them an advantage. Um, oh boy. So the nice thing is the shaman is the only elite, um, but we do have a swarm of enemies, so. And of course, we are two health below, which is annoying, but. Um, right, I will want to be in the back probably for this. Actually, no, maybe I want to be a little bit more forward so that I can hit everything that I want to hit. Are we grouping up or splitting off or? I feel like we should all focus on one set of enemies at a time. Okay. I feel like that's the way okay. we want to do this. Yeah. Um, so I am going to hit, pick a side, left or right. Doesn't matter to me. Um, let's just go uh, left. Left, okay. Left. Yeah, that's less okay. tiles for Craig Armour to, uh, to move. Let's see, make the rat move over there. Yes. Okay, then we'll do that. Um, uh, shit. I shit. am going to try to move early enough so that I can hopefully tank the Spellweaver. Um, is there any way that Sam can heal a bunch of us at the same time? I don't suppose you have the ability to do that. Uh, well, I don't. I don't have a. I have that. Oh no, I'm. I must have moved that out. I used to have the move and then heal. I should take that one back. That was a good one. Okay. Um, no, but I can put that decoy out. Um, that will right help. Away. Yeah. Yeah, that'll so, help. Thinking. What I might do is, Kevin, if you want to, either go, to the middle. Um. What I'm let's see is that the top? Oh, those are both tops. Okay. Because if these guys are melee anyway, my proximity mine will just take one out right away. Um, I can put it in front of me or next to me. Yeah, but they can also walk around it, just so you know. Um, How dare they? Yeah, I feel like if I put it right in front of me. Yeah. A decoy at this moment might be good just to help. Yeah, I've I think I'll just mitigate damage. Um, okay, so we're gonna focus on trying to kill the left as quickly as we can, and then, then from there we can figure out if it makes more sense to try to go after the archers because once the archers are in range, they're just gonna be firing at us, and it's just gonna be a pain in the butt. But I think I'm ready to go. Okay, I think I'm good. I, fortunately, these guys, yeah, they do an attack too, so it's not nothing to sneeze at. Attack two is still a lot, but we'll see how this goes. Sorry, I'm just changing up one thing. The right, shaman also. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. sorry. Go ahead. I was no, going to no, say that. Just... Uh, I was just going to mention that the shaman is also a ranged attacker, FYI. Okay. 
and he seems to have a longer range than the archers do. Range three. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, so he can't hurt us yet, but he'll be moving soon, I'm sure, because he has a movement too. Mm-hmm. Okay. Ready? Sorry. Okay. Ready, ready, ready. Okay, so the good news is... Um, the guards are not moving at all. They, but they are attacking and poisoning. So, oh. okay. yeah, just an FYI. Um, the archers are not moving at all, and the shaman is moving and blessing, which is going to be annoying. But we'll just have to deal with that. Okay. So here's the thing, Kevin. I know that it's an attack to poison, but they're about to do a shield. So if you can attack them before the shield is there, oh, you're about to do that. Yeah, do that. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, yeah, totally. <laughs> do that. Um, oh, nope, 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 nope. I want the further guy to attack that one. Okay. Yeah. Up, oh, I. Mess that up again. Okay. It's okay. It, it's all right. It's fine. It's it's fine. Uh, have him attack the one closer to us. Okay. The, the, yeah, have him attack that one. We don't want him getting within range of. No. Poo. Okay. Does that use my attack card? I think it uses theirs. Oh, you gotta get it. Yeah, that's the annoying thing. All right, it's okay. Immobilize the one, I guess, closest to us so he doesn't move up to the... Yeah. Okay. okay. Well, that sucked. Yeah, it's okay. Um, Kraghart's going to move just so that he's not in melee range of them. I don't want him to be in melee range. And I'm going to use Dirt Tornado and hit all three of these. Oh, yeah. Because he can. Okay. And then it muddles them, so that's good. Okay. Not that they're attacking this turn. So I guess the muddle doesn't really matter, but it's okay. We still damage them. These guards are gonna take a, their sweet time powering up. At least our curses are not in our decks anymore. That's yeah. a big thing. Um, okay. Archers can't do anything, and the shaman's gonna bless, which is bad. Oh, he's blessing himself, so that's not bad. Yeah, so only one bless card goes into the deck. All right, come on, archers. You're not doing anything. Let's go. All right, Tinker. Ooh. Um, do I want to? I'm gonna get one step close. Well, no, I'm gonna let him work for it. I don't want him to touch me. All right, let's do some decoy. Mm -hmm. There we go. go so here's the thing. Um, if you want, you can. Move to and immobilize one of the guards on the right, and then move early. That's what I was thinking about. Next doing. turn, yeah, move early before they can hit you. That's probably the best thing for you to use that card since they're melee. 
yeah, I would do that. Move two and immobilize one of them, probably the one closest to us. Should be able to move two. Yeah, it's not... Oh, cause I'm funny. Oh, oh, I see what's wrong. Oh, I see the problem. The mobilize is first, and then you move. So oh. never mind. Yeah, that's the annoying thing. Um, and then I move. Oh, okay. So you can stay put or move closer to them. I don't know if it matters. Um, I might move closer to you guys and then do like a buff next sure. round. I think sure. that's my best. Sure. One, two. Craig Hart's there. So yeah, I think this is probably the best. Okay. Because they'll target the decoy. Yeah. And that should give us some time to take these yeah. guys out. Shaman's moving up. He's gonna bless himself. Heal himself. Okay. I am having none of this. So I am going to attempt to kill things even though they're shielded. It's worth a try. I could conceivably kill the middle one. Ugh, it's okay. That's gonna kill that. Nice! Nice. Because what I really want to do is bring this person out. Yes, the ally! Yeah, yeah, this thing is gonna put some hurt. Okay. Fire and ice are on the board. Um. I think we're on to round two. Okay. Alright, are you guys planning on moving? Or staying here? Um, I was gonna move. Um, what were you about to do? I can move wherever you want me to. Are you, about to do, are you about to I do was... something that increases our attack? Yeah, I think I'm going to okay. do plus one. How early are you going? I'll have to go, if you're moving, I'll have to go after you, but okay. so that one is like I'm, a... I don't have to move. Um, I actually am fine staying, staying put, so if you just want to aura us now okay. from where you are. That works because you also are giving the mystic ally an attack as well yeah. an attack bonus with your aura so yeah just tell me what initiative you're going at um because it because i can also move in front of you too and then I, will, won't get it though. I would rather you stay back because you don't want to get hit by those you don't want to get hit by those guards okay yeah if you leave the aura that's when it goes away. Yeah, we're not, I'm not moving from my position. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna have to, but it's alright. Where are you planning on going? Uh, well, I, I could just start mopping up these guys. I was gonna move here and attack that guy and attack this guy, or I could move, start mopping up those guys, or start damaging those guys at least. Or like right there and attack. I think I might move here though and just start cleaning up. Alright, so I've got a twenty inch. Yeah, same. Oh same. I wonder how it does that. What's your initiative going to be, Sam? Uh, 20. Okay, then I'll go after you then. Alright, I'm ready to go. Oh. I keep forgetting to hit in selection. Okay, the guards are going before us. Oh. I think. No. No, they're going la late, which is good. Okay, so Shaman is disarmed. That's annoying. Move to attack two, range three, disarm. One, two. Okay, but they're going early, so that's good. Um, we'll see how this plays out. 
can't really uh, disarm anyone right now. And he's going to the right, so that's good. Keeps him away from us for a while while we mop up what's on the left. Archer is putting up down traps. Okay, I'm fine with them putting traps there. I am perfectly happy with that. As long as they're not attacking us directly. It's a lot of traps. Yeah. But if we we can conceivably push them into it, so Alright. Go for it, Tinker. Give us an ally. Give us an aura. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Success. Oh. Good job. I didn't think I was gonna kill it. Nice. Uh, go, Kevin, go. I... I'm going to have to move to the left. Or the right, I mean. To the right? Okay. Yeah, otherwise, I can't hit anyone. So. They should yep. prioritize my decoy anyway, so I think you're okay. Yeah, they should prioritize your decoy. So you can go right up and smack them. They're about to do a move one, attack three. Oof. Okay. But <laughs> if you go if you go up here, these two will attack the decoy, and this one will attack you. Just as an FYI. If you move here. Oh, they don't. They're not doing a poison though. It's just in. They're not. Attack. No, they're just doing a basic attack three. Okay, I guess. Yeah. If you move here, I, I mean, either way, they're, either way, two of them are going to hit the decoy, and one of them is going to hit you. Either way. Yeah. yeah. All right. But All yeah, right. we have to we have to kill these things. So, attack. If you're able to poison the shaman, that'd be fantastic. If you yeah. can poison the shaman. Yeah. But all in good due time. Mystic Ally, go for- oh, Mystic Ally went away from the- it's okay, she still killed it, so that's good. That's fine. Alright, now that I've got Aura Power, Aura Power, whenever the game decides to give me control, thank you, thank you. Um, here we go. Aura Power, and this is gonna muddle them too, which is great. Nice. Got a miss, but it's okay. Now I can do a move three, retaliate two, which is probably worth it. Yeah, because this is going to die if he attacks me. And that's going to, yeah, I'm going to, it's going to be worth it for me to move up. Because the shaman, yeah, yeah, it'll be worth it for me to go up because I can at least kill one of them. And if I do kill one of them, they the retaliate... If I do kill one of them and they happen to have retaliate, then the retaliate doesn't do any damage, just an FYI. But they don't have retaliate, so. Okay. More gold. More gold. Um. Okay. So let's see. I can do a. One, two. Um. If I use my boots, okay, that's awesome. So check this out. So I'm gonna do move two up to here. All allies and adjacent enemies suffer one damage just by default. So there's one damage. Then if I do an attack three range three and hit this guy, all allies and enemies adjacent to the target suffer one damage just by default. Nice, and then they get damage. Nice. And Earth is on the board. That's a good play. Good job. Amazing. Sweet. I'll take the damage and it's gonna die. Bye! And then that one's gonna hit the decoy because the decoy has lesser initiative, I think. Oh, there's a guard over there I didn't notice. There was an Inox guard back there. I didn't notice oh, that yeah. one. Oh, okay. That's a fine. 
That's cute. It's cute. Sure, decoy, take it. Cool. Good play. All right, round three. That was a good round for everybody. That was a really great round. All right. Um, I'm thinking about going here. Is anyone thinking about going there? About to where, I'm sorry? Um, yeah, that's fine. I would like to be here, if possible. Because oh, okay. I can hit four things. I can hit I can hit four things, including the shaman if I can get there. Assuming they don't move around. I can go here too, if that works, Kevin, if you wanna be if you need to be closer. Nah, I have to be within melee, so. Okay. Um okay, I gotta figure out. Alright, do you have any ranged attacks you can use instead? Uh, just burn range. Because, I mean, okay, so you can, if you want, you can go here. It's just I can only hit three three creatures instead of four. That's the only difference. So it's up to you. Um, no, it's okay. I'll, I just need to figure out Okay. where I can go. Well, I don't know if I should, you know what? I might not go that far anyway. I might only be going four squares, so forget what I said. Um, so move four. Is that one, two, three, All right, I think I'm good to go. Four. Is anyone taking care of this right, five guard? Or this, this guy down here? Um, I wasn't going to, so if, if Kevin can take care of that guard, that would be great. If... I feel like, Kevin, you probably should because you're right there in melee. You can get into melee with him if you can. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. While the rest of us move forward and tank for you, I'm, <laughs> I feel like that's the play. Yeah, I can help you out with that. I can give you um, two damage. Probably what I'm going to have to do. Okay. So... Yeah, leave the, the front line to the Spellweaver and the Cragheart. Um, a heal would be nice as well, if anyone can heal the Spellweaver. Oh, shoot. But. I didn't see that you took damage. Um... Yeah. I only have three left, if you can heal me. Um... That would be really good. Okay. Because I'm about to move up to the front lines. Then... Let me change my plan. Um... Unless you... Do you think you can wait one round? So that we can take out this guard back here and then the um, next round? Um, well, I'm going to be pretty far from you. I'm going to be I'll way be, up here I'll be right next here. round. And uh, then my thing, I just have to be within two squares. So I'll be able to get to you. And I'll heal you up for five. All right. We'll try. We'll see. You. Sure, we'll try. If you don't want to risk it, I can... I would, I mean, are you just, are you really, because you're trying to get rid of the guards, that why? Yeah, I just figured. It's fine, he's going to be stunned, I'll just stun him. Oh, he's going to be stunned? Because there's, there's, okay. yeah, ice yeah, if he's going to be stunned, yeah, if he's going to be stunned, you yeah, should heal me. Yeah, I can do that, and then, so what's your initiative? 70, so you have to go before oh. 70. Oh, I should go there and kill him, all right. Okay, um, let's see. What are you down by? By oh, four. I can just. I'm down four. That one then. Okay, cool. Sounds uh, great. That's a range three, so yeah, you should be within my range no matter what. All right, let's do that. Yeah, because I'm right now I'm range four away from you, so you would have to move. Four. Two. Yeah, you'll still be in my range regardless. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Thank you. Guard is. Um, going first and annoyingly. He's probably gonna hit. Well, no, you're you before me, so he's gonna hit your decoy, mm -hmm. which is good. He'll hit the decoy, not me. That's good. The decoy will get poisoned though. Actually, that's good because I don't want to be poisoned right now because then your heal is just gonna get rid of the poison and not actually heal me. So your decoy is very well placed. Hey. 
Thank you, Decoy. You're doing your job. <laughs>